Ubisoft just teased a potential buff for Twitch in patch 4.2. They tweeted out a screenshot of a drone view in the preparation phase, but it is sporting a Twitch drone icon in the weapons bar. This hints at a potential change for Twitch, where she will be able to use her shock drone in the preparation phase maybe. If this is the case, it could be both good and bad for Twitch. Even though her shock drone is not particularly strong right now, and due to its size and slow speed way too easy to shoot, just the fact that she gets access to 3 drones in a round and her exceptionally good farmers make her a good pick already. If the shock drone remains unchanged otherwise, using it in the preparation phase might just be a surefire way to get it destroyed right away, negating any gadget advantage Twitch might have. But if they made further adjustments to her drone, such as increasing the taser range, making the drone smaller and giving it the ability to jump, this could be a potential game changer. Zapping bandits' batteries or mutes gemmers before the round even has started could be very useful. If you played it smart you could even damage enemy players before you spawn in yourself, giving you the advantage right away. What do you think Ubisoft will do? I think it's a potentially very interesting change and honestly one I haven't even considered so far. On a general note, I appreciate that Ubisoft keeps reworking operators in favor of just tweaking numbers in an effort to balance them. So far they were always really keen to properly rework operators such as changing the shape of Blitz's shield, reworking how Montagne's shield works and completely redoing Pulse's heartbeat scanner. I hope they actually allow us to use Twitch's drone in preparation phase, if only just to see how it would play out. And who knows, maybe there's still hope for a properly reworked Tachanka.